This is the reason why you need to be in a property ownership. I'm not talking about housing ownership. You own a house, I love you to death. I got a cousin, uh, Alexis Lance. She's a great realtor. Yeah, gosh, I've seen her rise. She's a shooting star. She gives me tons of inspiration. We're in two, we're, she's heads of a quarter. I'm on the tail side of the same quarter. And I love what she does. You need to go buy a home from her. If she was selling up here, she'd be my realtor. Um, she's family, but she is a wonderful person, a godly woman. And I will just watch her soar. And she's had struggles. Um, there is nothing wrong with owning a home if that's what you want. The thing is, what else outside of that? Right? Because the, the home is where you live and dwell. But you can't generate anything off of that because the market can take it away. Um, so my wanting a home is a different reason for wanting to own land. Land can create wealth for you. Ask me how. Ancestry Lands. Phil Davis. So here's the thing. At my event that I went through, this video at the end is the people that I met. Um, now, New York City, anybody knows New York City, you're going to get a lot of different demographics. You know, um, I met Schumann and Kennell. They're from Haiti. Um, uh, Gentina Coleman and, and Quint Coleman, they're, um, I guess, Queens. And she's a realtor. Gentina's a realtor as well. Um, they were Jamaican descent, things like that. Um, and then I met Jeffrey. Jeffrey sat next to me the whole time at the meeting, things like that. And he was on the fence about doing the commercial multifamily. I'm like, Jeffrey, man, you need to do this. You know, he goes to seminars all the time. We laugh about it because he's like seminar junkie. And he's like, man, my girlfriend and I, we always argue over, you want to go and do this. You got all these ideas, but he just made a decision and went forward. And I was so happy for him because I could see him struggling. He's looking for a way out and a chance. And I'm like, dude, make a decision and go for it with it if this is what inspires you he's looking at me he's like you do real estate too why are you not going I, i'm just in land right now this is everything's a step for me i don't skip steps but i want him to be successful because hey if he's doing commercial and he's successful guess who, who knows him i do <laughs> that's the reason why i may not be doing it today but i might know them and there's business we can do into there and then there's a whole lot of ways to make money and it's not just doing one thing. But again, that's the point is that I'm making connections. You're buying from a person who's making connections, who has other resources to offer than just land. Like this video, subscribe. You watch this long. Here's the video I recorded at the end with all of us together. All right, here we go. One more time. Phil Davis, we left somebody out. Ancestry Lands. We're here in the Sheridan, New York. We're closing up multifamily. I met Mercedes, Kennell, yes, yes. Jeffrey Schumann, Jatita, and Q, Q, Quentin. They know about it, Ancestry Lands. Go buy some land. We're trying to move to multifamily. We're trying to build a kingdom, build some wealth, yes, sir. Yes, right? Sir. We're going to go buy some land on three. One, two, three. Go buy some land. In the multifamily. So you saw the video of Tyler at I at the gym. I'm in the Sheridan, New York, Times Square. I booked a night, not because I'm this great, good person, whatever else. My room was nice and small, just how like I didn't need nothing special. But I'm there. I went to a deli. I'll show you a video of Jeffrey and I talking about this one place we went to eat to right now. Try not to eat there. Not a recommended for me. So... I'm gonna go somewhere else to go get food and take my business somewhere else. So I'm not gonna argue with them. I have enough strength to at least walk out of it and don't let anybody push you even if it's something that you wanna buy to, you know, don't be forced to purchase an item that you don't particularly like, but I'm not gonna pay for it just because the guy's pushing me to do that. First of all, they didn't even listen to what I wanted. Second of all, he's trying to sell me something I have no interest on because that's what, they want us to sell, buy, but I wouldn't do it. Why? What do you think, Jeff? Right, exactly, because you have, you have, you, you, you're the customer. Right. You understand? So you have the right to order and what, and what to say. They're right. not going to be rude. They're very rude. Very, very. Rude. very. I, was so. three, I was like three um, seconds just walking out. Yeah, definitely. So there you go. Ancestry Lands, one of my no recommendations. Don't do it. So I'm going somewhere else to get business. You can see we had such bad service. I didn't even eat there. All right. And because of just, it, I'm sorry, I'm not trying to ruin their business or anything like that, but their, their sanitation part was a big problem for me. And the way I was treated was just oddly disrespectful. There was an accident right in the middle of Times Square. I'm right in Times Square at the Sheridan. You can look it up right on 7th and, and 
7th or 7th Street and 80 something, whatever else. But the Sheridan, right in Times Square, I'm right there. Um, and there's an accident, it took all day. I was like, oh, maybe I'll go viral for this. But I put it in there just to show you all my experience. All right, Bill Davis, Ancestry Lands. I'm in New York City, Times Square, right here at the Sheridan. And look at this mess. <laughs> this is a classic New York thing. I used to live in New York. I guess this guy hit this lady right here. And then the guy in the back has this van. He's trying to get through, but she's arguing with him. And nobody can understand why in the world they can't just get over. But she's arguing. And the cop is right there. You see this? So she's just ripping his behind open. Look at this. And what's wrong where Mercedes Benz, right? You can see this, right? Everybody's beeping and hoeing and I don't know. Maybe I just got a moment. But he's out there like, just move your dad, go on Mercedes, lady. You know? So look how much traffic's that back there. Yeah, sorry. Sorry about that. But look, look, look at that, look at that. All up in the mix. Can't nobody else get through. There's a police officer right back behind there, but I guess they don't do anything anymore, so that's a little crazy. So they don't, I don't know if the police do. You got people just walk right out and the cars are right there and they about to hit themselves, but look at this. Because I'm really doing things. I'm not just selling land, sitting at home, I'm out making connections, talking to people who hear about Ancestry Lands. This is some online brand. I'm not online branding. I'm in Jersey, I'm now I'm in New York. People know about you as being a property owner. They're gonna go buy land in that area. The more land they buy, guess who's getting more value and more wealth being created? People who already own land from me. I told you guys before, every client will tell you of mine. I tell them before they purchase that land, when they do put that down payment in, I'm always working for you after you bought land from me. Even when you own it, I am still working for you to bring you more value and increase the value of your lands. Other land people, they ain't doing that. I'm out there, you'll see me, I'm wearing my Ancestry Lands shirt, <sighs> Ancestry Lands on the back, there with people who are millionaires, multifamily, talking and looking me up. They wanna know who's Ancestry Lands, and I'm telling them, go buy over here, buy land. I'm, I'm not trying to sell them. I'm just letting them know what I'm doing because I know somebody's looking at that that's a millionaire and saying, I'm going to go put some money in that land over there, which means your land values are going up because more people are buying land in that area. It's We're creating an emerging market. That's where you need to be with Ancestry Lands. $1,000 down, 200 250 a month. Like this video, share, go talk to people about it. Look at some other videos. Put your money in a place where your money can appreciate Put your money in a place where somebody's working for you, not selling you. I'm not selling you anything because the land sells itself. I'm telling you is that after you buy the land, I'm working to bring your values up even higher. What they're doing for investors, I'm doing for owners. You know, investors, someone put money in, they want a profit. I'm telling you, you own this and your values go up. You can sell at any time or you can have something that your kids can inherit that's of real value value that's being created and you haven't done one thing with it it's just sitting there it's the mother earth dirt grass whatever you want to call it but it's there and it's going up no matter people talk about cali all day doesn't matter land's going up they they have a problem with land there and there's not enough of it where they want to put millions and millions of people at so what do they do they're putting, they're building up on the outskirts. That's where I'm at. And I've been there for years, all right? Phil Davis, Ancestry Lands, I really hope that you've been inspired by this journey. You've listened to this video this far. I'm gonna be doing more videos like this, man. I'm gonna talk to you about my journey and what I'm doing, what I've got planned. For the people that are want a little bit more, I'm gonna teach some of my land people strategies on how to really, really build up a huge portfolio and, and really just say, all right, <laughs> I'm gonna create I, I now I've got my, I've got my kids covered. I'm working on grandkids. I'm going to tell you guys how to get your grandkids covered. All right. That's what I'm working. I got my kids covered now, but I'm going to work on grandkids. I'm going to show you guys how to do that. I hope you're excited. Ooh, I got more coming for you. Go to ancestrylands.com, ancestrylands on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter. I'm everywhere. Ancestry Lands. Name in the back, baby. Ancestry Lands. One generation to the next. Phil Davis signing off. Remember. Knowledge is power. 
ownership leads to power all right if you don't own property you'll be owned as property baby go get some land ancestry lands got you covered phil davis signing out take care folks don't forget to like share and subscribe <laughs>